Diamond Bullseye every week with her hard riding. Straight shooting. And suspense. I'm out of there. Throw that express bag down. I can't. I'm hit, man. That's Annie Oakley. Now we'll see what the passengers have got to contribute. Those dirty killers. Never thought Annie Oakley would turn bad. She's the niece of the sheriff of Diablo. Well, that don't make this bullet hurt any less. I reckon a lawman's kid could go bad just like the rest of them. I'm surprised at you. You ought to know better than to ask me to do a thing like that. You see, Billy? He wouldn't believe me when I said you wouldn't kill anything unless you were starving to death. Well, what tag means is that you never shoot at birds or animals unless you're hungry and need food. And you've never killed any people either, have you, Annie? Well, that's the most important thing to learn about a gun tag. You never shoot except in self-defense. And even then, you don't aim to kill. I gotta see you right away. What's the trouble, Lofty? Come inside. Take a look at this. Wanted, dead or alive, Annie Oakley. What kind of a joke is this? We didn't see. $1,000 reward will be paid for the capture, dead or alive, of Annie Oakley and male accomplice who held up the Smoky River stage. Robbing it of Wells' Fargo bag, looting the passengers, wounding the driver, and killing an unarmed passenger in cold blood. Notify Clem McDaniels, Sheriff, Smoky River. Well, Clem McDaniels is an old friend of my uncle's. He's no friend of yours. Dead or alive, it says. Where'd you get this, Lofty? I was delivering those legal notices over to Cottonwood Junction. Those things are plastered in every tree in Smoky River County. And he's never been near Smoky River. How could you hold up any stage? Well, they've evidently gotten me mixed up with somebody else, Tag, but what puzzles me is 
Why did Sheriff McDaniel send out these reward notices without first trying to get in touch with me? Do you know him? I haven't seen him since I was knee-high to a pumpkin seed, but when I was a kid, he used to bounce me on his knee. I'd like to bounce him off mine. I'll get over there and straighten him out. Oh, no, Lofty, you can't leave Diablo. At least not until Uncle Luke gets back from the court at the county seat. Well, there's nothing to stop me. Slow down, Tag. You can't make that long trip all by yourself. No, there's only one person that can clear this up, and that's me. Oh, Tag, fill up the water canteen for me, will you, and bring my bedroll outside? All right, Annie. Annie, I don't think you'd better go. If these things spread all over, somebody's going to take a pot shot at you. Ah, uh, I've been pot shot at before. Yeah, but $1,000 can improve their aim. Don't worry about it, Lofty. I'll just have to count on seeing them first. Besides, I don't cotton to the idea of somebody parading around ruining my good name. I'm the only one that's got a right to do that. Thanks, Tag. But Lofty needs you here to take care of things in Diablo. Sure do. Oh, Lizzie Cat. So long. Hey. You heard what Annie said. taking you in, dead or alive. But you've got the wrong girl. I'm Annie Oakley. We know that. You're the one we want. No, you don't. That's just somebody that's pretending to be me, and I've come here to prove it. Well, can't you hear me? I've come here from Diablo to prove I'm innocent. You're a liar and a killer. Take me to the sheriff of Smoky River, and he'll clear everything. All right, we'll take it to him. Will you come up with your hands up? Yes. Throw down your rifle. Now your pistol. All right, come down now with your hands up. Search her. She might have a knife on her. You can't tell about this gal. All right, that's enough. If you'll just take me to Sheriff McDaniel, he'll straighten this whole thing out. All right. We'll take it to him. Get her horse. Come on. We found him dead on the trail after he went hunting for you. Not me, I tell you. He was a friend of mine, and he'd tell you so himself if he was alive. Well, seeing as how he ain't, I guess we'll just have to draw our own conclusions. So, as acting sheriff, I'm placing you under arrest. All right, boys, lock her up. Oh, no, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Word to Diablo to the deputy sheriff, Lofty Craig. He'll set you straight about me. No, no, sirree. I may be a little green to the sheriff in business, but I ain't falling for an old trick like that. If I send word to Diablo, your outlaw friends might find out and try to spring you out of jail. But they won't do Get in there. What's the rope for? That gun crazy prisoner you've got. Now, wait a minute, man. Let's do this legal. Let's not have any lynching. Because she's a woman, the judge might not hang her. We're here to see that justice is done. Well, let's give her a fair trial, then. What kind of a fair trial did she give the sheriff before she murdered him? And what about the stagecoach robbery? 
What chance did she give them? We're not going to have a necktie party. Now get out. Nobody elected you, Sheriff. You've got no right to order us around. I'm acting, Sheriff, and as long as I am, you'll do as I say. Give me that rope and get out of here. Thanks, Sheriff. I'm glad to see somebody still has some respect for law and order around here. Well, don't get the wrong idea. I'm just as anxious to see you hang as they are. The stagecoach driver you shot down is my best friend. And for your sake, I hope he doesn't die. Annie, come back. That's what I was going to ask you. You're worried too, aren't you, Lofty? Me? Uh, now Annie can take care of herself. Then what are you reading that paper upside down for? Oh, you're right, Tag. She should have been back a long time ago. When your Uncle Luke returns, I'm going to go look for her. That may be too late. I'm going right now. It isn't so far. Forget it, Tag. That's too dangerous a trip for a young boy to take. You don't have to treat me like I was a two-year-old. Stop acting like one. Go ahead and start your homework. What's the big hurry? Maybe you'd rather have them howling for your scalp instead of Annie Oakley. They won't. She walked in just in time to stick her head in a noose. Well, let's leave it there and travel. murder victim dies. Jake Slocum stays driver, died today of gunshot wounds inflicted by Annie Oakley during the robbery of the Smoky River stage. I tell you, Johnson, female or not, she's still a murderer, and it's time we did something about it. Well, I'm not stopping you any longer. All right, men, we'll form our own vigilante committee and do our duty.
I get the key. Hurry up. If you know any prayers, you better get them said quick. You're a mighty brave bunch, aren't you? Only five men against an unarmed woman. Not a woman, a murderer. Well, you'll be worse than murderers. Lynching is a crime against all law. We're here to see that justice is done. Justice doesn't hide behind masks. Why don't you give me a fair trial so I can prove my innocence? We have enough proof to suit us. Be the first time a woman murder has been hung. Lofty! Let her go. That's Annie Oakley. Yes, and she's a cold-blooded killer. She's no more a killer than I am. I'm Lofty Craig, Deputy Sheriff of Diablo. That doesn't give you any authority on Smoky River. Where's Sheriff McDaniels? Dead. And she shot him. Oh, they're lynch crazy, Lofty. They wouldn't even give me a chance to prove my innocence. I let her go. We'll let the law handle this. So keep your hands away from your guns and stand aside. Watch out, Annie! And you claim to be innocent. I am innocent, but I can't prove it dangling from the end of a rope. Stand here. How about that cabin over there, Annie? Good. Same goes for you, mister. Drop those guns and get your hands up. All right, Annie. Gosh, Annie, am I glad to see you. I thought they hung 
you by this time. No, thanks to them, I wasn't. I'm mighty flattered, Miss Whatever Your Name Is. I didn't know I was so famous. All right, you two. Outside. Drop that gun. This time, Maniofa, you won't get away. Sorry to hear that, gentlemen. This ought to prove what I've been telling you. Here's a woman that's been acting as me in those holdups. That's a lie. I'm Annie Oakley. She's just trying to throw you off. That's the real Annie Oakley. There's Deputy Sheriff Diablo. I'm ready to swear that she was nowhere near Smoky River at the time of those killings. Don't listen to him. He's her outlaw accomplice. This is the real Annie, and I can prove it. She is not. I ought to know my own sister. That's all right, Tag. Annie Oakley has quite a reputation for being able to handle a gun. If she's who she claims she is, let her prove it to us by showing us just how good she can shoot. All right, you go first. Tag, pick up a couple of pieces of shale and toss them up in the air. All right, now you're gonna see some real sharp shooting. Already, bub. All right, then. Let's see you try this. The idea is to draw and fire before this coin can hit the ground. It looks simple, but it's really the hardest trick of all. Sally! A hole plot through the middle! You'll all get if you make a move. Now the rope on her. We ain't through with it just yet. You don't mean you're gonna hang her. Why not? This time there's no mistake. No, there isn't. We're out of Smoky River territory now and Lofty's authority holds good here. So turn her loose. We're holding these two for trial by the district judge and if y'all don't hightail it out of here we might hold you too. How'd you know this was outside of Smoky River territory, Annie? I didn't. Well, by the time they find out I was wrong, we'll have these two safely tucked in jail. Holy sassafras! You're only kidding! Listen, the less you say, the better, young man. You still have to answer to me for running away from Diablo. But, Annie, I saved your life. Didn't I track down these desperados and trick them into catching me and holding me prisoner till you and Lofty got here? Well, I hadn't thought of it like that, Tag. Much obliged for saving my life. No trouble at all, sis. Call on me any time. <laughs> 